go go. Can you play Major Laser on Pandora? Sure. Here's a Pandora station called Major Laser Radio. <laughs> day trying to record and like introduce the vlog and be like hi icons welcome back to my channel my name is Eunice if you're not subscribed go ahead and subscribe if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button if you don't like the video go ahead and hit the dislike button and then leave a constructive criticism in the comments that's what I wanted to do. But we were in the store, we were at um, Home Goods. I was trying to get candles and I cannot shop and talk with the camera because my sister was also there. So I get like discombobulated. So I just decided that I'm gonna put the camera away and just do what I'm doing, come home and continue from there. So when I came home, I showed you guys a little bit of a montage of me and my family trying to cook and stuff which is like really really good that we're doing that more often now i think that's just like a good new year's thing that we just started to do like cooking together hanging out together a little bit more so yeah but yeah um for the rest of the day after i made the breakfast i just decided that i'm just gonna hang out on the couch and finish editing i put some tags on my video a title on my video that's coming out on monday if you haven't seen it i'm gonna put a card up top so you can go and watch it but yeah um right now i'm about to like decompress aka take a shower hit my bed my actual bed and like you know just waste away for the rest of the night by sleeping i'm gonna watch a little bit of tv there's a few vloggers that just dropped vlogs so i'm gonna watch them and then i'm gonna hit the haystacks and sleep yeah I did not hang out with you guys a lot today, honestly. That's the fun part about being an introvert. You get to just detach from people with long periods of time to the point where you start to feel like absolutely lonely. Then you're like, oh, people, that's me. So yeah, please do not take offense to the fact that I did not show you the rest of my day. I try to like record myself doing like editing and stuff like that, but I don't know if I'm gonna insert those clips in here. But yeah, if I do, you'll see them. If I don't, then just know I didn't like the quality and how they turned out. But yeah, I'm about to say goodnight to you guys for today. I'm going to try to continue the vlog tomorrow. Probably do like a little mini get ready with me, which is very simple. We all know I'm not about to do makeup. So it's going to be a simple get ready with me. But yeah, I will catch you guys tomorrow. I just wanted to close the vlog out for tonight, for today. I know today wasn't that much. I can't promise tomorrow will be any better, but I'll see y'all. Good morning, icons. It is Sunday, and I am getting ready for church. I'm gonna do my hair. I am about to do my hair because it's Sunday, and I'm getting ready for church. I did the twists. I know they kind of make me look juvenile, but it's okay because. I guess that's the benefits of having black hair. You can look young for as long as you possibly want. Um, I'm just like spraying moisture into my hair right now. I'm spraying like, I have this spray from, what is it called? Shea Moisture. And then I am using As I Am. I love this brand. I love this brand a lot. Um, I'm just gonna spray it all over. And then um, I am going and then I'm going to do this like braiding sheen oil spray 
this one has a lot of different ingredients in which I should probably do research on but it has a bunch of oils in it as well so I just want to spray that in since it's oily to like lock your moisture okay. Once, the one thing I hate about twisting my hair is that they tend to want to curl look at this one Alright, so yeah. Alright, I'll do like this. Go ahead and brush it down and then, oops, brush it down. I'm just gonna brush it so you can see my part. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of gel in the front. I don't do, I think I've told you guys this before, but I don't do twist outs because they never come out right and I always look worse than when I started. So I always leave my twists in and I just move around life like this. If this is like not a style that you're into, but you would like to try it, I say you should just try it. It's your hair, it's your head. I mean, and people have something to say, they can mind their goddamn business. But with all honesty, I have never had anybody like question my natural hair. No, I think only one person and she was black, but I've never had a Caucasian go in on my natural hair when I have it out like ever because the lawsuit still. So at work, they just received my hair however way I give it to them. And this is for all jobs I've ever had. I've never had a job where the person was like, Ew, your natural hair. They've always just like minded their business when it comes to my natural hair. And nobody has given me any issues. So I know that's like the argument for a lot of black women as to why they don't want to wear their own hair. It's because, oh, you know, my job might not like it or I might get crucified for it. I feel like... That used to be a narrative, but I feel like if we all band together and just say F it, eventually everybody would just have to deal with our hair. And that's that on that. But I get it. If you're still just like, it's not for me. Like my sister, she doesn't like just having her hair out like that. Because one, she doesn't like dealing with it in the morning. And two, it's just not her thing. And I'm okay with it. I'm like, girl, do you? So she wears like she will wear braids. Sometimes, rarely, she may wear a wig or two, but she does usually have her braids in. <clears throat> so I'm just trying to make sure my edges look presentable because the thing that makes my hair the most problematic is like the fact that sometimes my edges have a mind of their own. And my hair is already in a very simple style. Having your hair all over the place in the front doesn't help. <clears throat> I, I really wish I could do the swoop. I feel like every black girl knows how to do the lay edges swoop. and Except for me. I honestly cannot do it. Cannot. I just always do my own thing and hope for the best most of the time. That's what's given now. I really hate it. Just swoop the way I want you to. I really struggle with getting the swoop. I do. Alright, well, this is as best as I'm gonna get for today and that's okay the other day I was listening to Lil Wayne and I can't remember which song but he had this line where he was like he said I can't always do but I do what I can profound prolific even very profound it means a lot meaning like you know you can't always come through all the time but you do what you can to come through all the time Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So I'm feeling about these edges today. I can't always lay them down, but I'm doing 
what I can to make sure they are presentable. Alright, but I'm about to go put some clothes now and call it a day. This is it. I'll probably tie my hair down so my actual twist will lay and then but yeah. Plain Jane on the move. Plain Jane. I feel like it could be a bust down as a plain Jane. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, it's a very gloomy day, so the lighting in my room is a little bit different. Oh, shoot. Chin, chin, chin. Damn. Alright, so I'm all dressed. Well, I do what I can. I can't always do, but I do what I can. Alright, so this is just a simple outfit I have on. I'm going to work after too, so. I just have this sweater from Ross, pants from Ross. And I'm going to try and put it with, um, I'm just going to try and put it with this white mule. Let me see. Oh, this is cute. Yeah, super simple, super cute. So this is what it looks like. Let me tilt you all down a bit. So you can see. So this is what it looks like. And I'm probably going to carry uh maybe I'll just carry my brown. I'll probably just carry this. Change my bags. Orange. don't know what jacket to wear you hey guys look what happened to my phone case phone phone I need to I got another one I already ordered another one already so oh, cool good thing they reminded me cuz <clears throat> that was not gonna remember yeah, I got a new phone case. I got a new phone case from Amazon. They should be on the way, but this happened over the weekend, and I just can't deal. So now I'm just walking around with this, the um, like this part around my phone because I keep dropping my phone. So I'm hoping like even this little can protect it a bit. I've already broken my screen once, and I had to go to, um, I had to go to Apple to get it fixed. All right, I already like signed off, but. You guys want to see this footage before my sign off, but my, I want to see, show you guys my sister's outfit. She straight stunting on these. I can't say the word. But come on, Piviats, Piviats, you better, you better. Mm. 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 Oh, let me open it up so they can see. And then oh. I have on like a white shirt underneath. Piviats. That's it. That's it. Y'all. Yeah. My sister bought this yesterday for me because it's this algae they grow and it's supposed to have health and like it has a lot of nutrients in there. It has like potassium, vitamin B12. Tell them about all the vitamins. Magnesium. It has a lot of good. Show them. I mean, it's a really small, it's like super small. So it has all these ingredients and I'm like, yeah, buy it because I want to have it because I must be nutritionized. So I woke up this morning and I was gonna record it on my camera but I left it upstairs and I'm not going back upstairs and I mixed it with my collagen so it just looks like a really dark green juice and I'm like I'm just gonna drink it yeah bro when I said this tastes like nothing it's not the taste it's the after smell it's like a it's like a it's like I grew up with fish smell you know what I mean that aquarium the very Aquarius an aquarium like um, so I'm gonna try to get it in my mouth. <laughs> okay. You got it. It's I'm just, just a little bit left. So <laughs> why would you smell it? <laughs> oh, oh, oh why did 
did you Ooh. smell it? Because now Ooh. that's going to be in your brain. No. No, I got this. I got a chaser. Milk? I got a milk chaser. Okay. Immediately no. <laughs> Immediately no. <laughs> How much of it is left? It's so much of it left. I'll be here too. I've been here for like 20 hours. It's almost like 20 minutes trying to drink this. I think if you do it with milk next time, it might not be that bad. Mm -mm. <laughs> I can't finish it. You can't. Mm -mm. Okay. You can't. I just can't smell it's it. It's so much. Chug, chug, chug. I can't finish it. The you're, smell is too much. You're almost done though. Becky, whose <laughs> side are you on? What if I die? I don't know what this thing does to the body. I'm just trying it out. Oh. I have a feeling that your stomach this might about be. about to be lit up like the you're about, to, <laughs> you're about to be talking okay. to somebody. You're about to be like, oh. And a whoop. <laughs> are you okay? No. Um, I need a one minute. minute. <laughs> Just one minute. I'll be right with you. It's the blackness for me. It's so dark. It's like a dark green color too. I already feel the bubbles. Really? Oh no. Um. Yeah, I'm not finishing that. Oh. Yeah. Should Let's I have think? a moment. Maybe to like a couple. You got it. Mind over matter. Alright, the residue is not coming in my mouth. Two chasing it with. Mm, 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 mm. Hell tomorrow. Superman that Okay, very Superman levels. Oh my god. Mm -mm. That was nasty. But it's in my stomach now, so only they will tell. <laughs> Let me grab my um my croissant. I will have to see you guys when I come home from work, maybe because um my family and I we're probably gonna sit do another sit down and like work out our schedule this night. But I'm not sure if I wanna get on camera or not. But if I don't get back on camera, I hope you guys have a lovely Sunday. And if you're working, stay strong. If you're going to church, say a prayer for me. <clears throat> I'm going to church and work, so it's going to be a day. But I will catch you guys either this evening or tomorrow. Tomorrow is a day off, so we'll be able to do a little bit more. Hi, icons. Welcome. All right, today is Monday, and um, I have done a lot. I woke up this morning at like 8. I made a new um, band banner i made a new banner for like my ig i mean excuse me i'm a little tired i made a, a banner for my youtube i love it so this is what it looks like that's my new banner i know look how cute it is i love it so much so i spent the morning doing that and then me and my sister and my mom we went um grocery shopping and then we went shopping shopping i feel so bad because i i mean i am doing really well with saving like don't get me wrong i'm putting money to the side every month when i get paid but i really need to control my shopping habits it's so bad but the things i got are so cute so i'm really excited um i want to show you guys what i got oh uh, a giant bag from Ross but I didn't get everything from Ross some of it is from the thrift store and I'm like gassed about it and I'm like super duper excited to um, I'm super duper excited to like wear them and show you guys them so first off let's get into these boots I have been looking for boots like this 
for so long for so long okay i got these from um the thrift store we have a thrift store here called something like red white and blue or something like that and yo that thrift store first of all is always packed and they got good stuff I got this there i was looking throughout the store and i'm like oh my god this entire store and nobody has my size nobody has my size but then i pulled this out i looked at it i put it on my feet it's my size it's from this brand called carlos by carlos santana i guess it's i don't know carlos santana made shoes anyways i love it i think they're really sexy um i already have outfits in my head for them and then this is the other pair so then i got that and then i got i should start doing like try on hauls but the thing is i am trying to not encourage people to go and spend their hard-earned money which is why i don't know if i should jump on the bandwagon of like doing hauls and things of that nature but i got this this is really on trend right now these like yoga pants with like the flare out i got it in this like i think on camera it's like a brownish topish mauve like color i don't know if y'all can see it anyways it's really really fitted it's the small it's super long yeah so there's that really excited for this this one i got from ross and then I got another, I want a bunch of pants that are like these. I got another like very relaxed look. Um, something you can really quickly wear to the store. I'm currently playing myself. My other video, my other vlog dropped this morning. No, not this morning. It drops this afternoon. So I'm like watching it. I try to watch it for the full, um, I watch it for like the full vlog and thumbs up it you gotta support yourself can't nobody support you like you support you so i always watch it once it's live on youtube and then i wait to see how many other people watch it oh this one is the one my mom got so that's what i'm doing now so that's what's playing in the background the volume is on low i got the skirt like this is so cute i want to pair this particular skirt with those boots and like a oversized sweatshirt and it's going to be fire it's a express it's from express so unless i tell somebody i thrifted this it's from express and then i'm about to go wash these actually and then i got this other one this is white house black market another mini skirt uh they're short but they're not too short they will look really good with like oversized sweatshirts, oversized sweaters, and some boots, especially in the winter time. Let me show you what this one looks like. Oh, yeah, yeah. Perfect, right? I am obsessed. Obsessed. As much as I would like to try these on, as much as I would like to try these on, um, I'm really tired. So I can't. Ah, oh, look at this love this this is a absolute oversized sweatshirt like get into it a quick grab and go you can never go wrong with these like forever and ever how fire is this i love this i don't know how i'm gonna style this yet oh honestly i feel like this is one gonna be one of like my grab and go my warmer light is on over here and i'm by the window because today's lighting is trash it's been raining all day all day so yeah so that's what i got i do have one more activity that i kind of want to do today um i want to mix my lotion i don't know if i want to end the vlog here today or what but i gotta go put these in the wash I definitely gotta go wash these because they're from the thrift store and i gotta disinfect my boots because they're from the thrift store and then um east coast always in me commonwealth little j
don't get in love from my city yeah. I roll call for the DMV In my own lane, you could still ride with me yeah. Lord knows I made mistakes You won't end, but it's too late I don't need your support just to know I'm important I won't ever sell myself short Cause I know you'll see me on the come up all right, so yeah, the process is a little bit messy, but that's how I usually would do it. I would just like pour my coconut oil, pour whatever oil I want to put in there, and then just whip it with whatever utensil I could find. I know it's a little, you know, juvenile, not juvenile. I know it's a little like unprofessional. I know it's a little unprofessional, but I'm not a professional cream maker and it's not me making cream. I just, my body needs a lot of moisture and the lotions are not doing it. So I have to mix my lotion with a little bit of oil and a little bit of water just to get a good consistency that works for me. I have done this a lot and I enjoy doing it and I just wanted to make you guys part of the process and show you guys what I do. So yeah, that's what I do. I know it's not like up to par. It's not even close to aesthetically pleasing. It's a little bit messy, but it's a fun little project that I like to do. And I enjoy doing it, even though I make a lot of mess. All right, so yeah, I did not finish my skincare. I started it in the bathroom. I started it in the bathroom and I was recording a morning routine. It took everything in me because I think I'm coming down with a cold and it's a head cold. It's like right in my sinuses. Uh, it's so painful. I just can't stand it. I don't love it at all. I really, really don't. I don't love that for me. And today on my agenda, I'm not working, but I'm about to do my laundry, which I've been saying I want to do since when did I wash my bathroom? like last saturday i've been saying i want to do my laundry since like last saturday and i feel like today it's like no other day i don't have a lot of editing to do sure i start, have to start editing this vlog but i don't have a lot of editing to do so i think it's a perfect day to just do some chores and then i have to go to the post office because i never dropped off my rock box um and i have to go to the doctors today as well because my lab reports came back. I did a lab the last visit I went to, to do. So today my lab reports came back and they're gonna give me, they're gonna tell me what may or may not be wrong with me. Or if I need to change my eating habits or drinking habits or whatever else habits that I may have developed that's bad for me. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. So yeah, so it's laundry, run errands, by errands, I mean dro drop off my, what is the word? Drop off my rocks box <laughs> at the post office along with this package I ordered from Amazon. I already put it back in the box, but my phone, I don't know if I showed you all. This is my phone case. This is supposed to be on my phone protecting it. But this fell off and I'm pretty sure I showed you guys earlier in the week and I was like, oh, I'm going to order a new one. Why are you doing this to me with the lighting today, bro? Uh, come on, babes. Let's get it together. All right. Um, yeah, so I, I got to turn another way. It is just not working for me with the lighting. You can barely see me. Excuse my dry lips. I just finished my skincare. Actually, let me put lip gloss on it. Um, yeah, so I need to take the package back because my dumb self sat there i sat there and i ordered uh i order i ordered a iphone 12 i have an iphone 11. now if you have the iphone 15 or the iphone 14 good good on you you're 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 beyond your years I, for me i'm gonna keep the old ones because ain't nothing change but a screen so i'm gonna keep that until they decide that they're gonna give us holographics when we FaceTime people. That's where it's at. Once that comes out in technology, iPhone gonna get my money again, and I'm gonna give them all of it. I'm gonna be like, here, take it. But until then, I'm keeping my old phone. So I have an iPhone 11, and I ordered an iPhone 12 case from Amazon. The case came, I tried to fit it on, 
it doesn't fit so I'm going to try and return that along with my rocks box and if you're wondering what rocks box is um this is absolutely not sponsored so rocks box looks like this it comes like this so rock box honestly is just okay it's just a jewelry service I've been using them for years now probably like two three years now and basically they help you kind of try out different jewelry so it's like a jewelry subscription box every month they'll take a $21 out of your bank account in in and they put it towards like whatever purchase you want to make in the future and the way that works is when they take that money out maybe a, a let's say a jewelry in the box that came to you cost like $56 they will add the $21 to that $56 so you won't have to pay as much so you probably have to pay probably about I want to say 35 if you take let me do the math 56 minus 21 615 yeah so 35 so you'll be paying about $35 instead of a full $56 at the time that you're paying obviously you've paid ahead of time but you get the point um so yeah i've been using them if you in my old channel before i started doing like the podcast with my dad on that channel in my own channel i kind of talked about why i started using this particular service i just have anxiety when i go to go buy jewelry it just overwhelms me there's too much options clothes i'm fine jewelry oh no so i was like i do want to get some more like gold pieces so i decided to start using their service and it really helps because it's like a surprise every month I don't know what I'm gonna get and sometimes I can look it up sometimes I can edit it but I usually try to wait until I get the box so I can be surprised um, so yeah they send it to you you can try it out for as long as you want as long as you take care of the, the products that's in there you can try it out for as long as you want and then if there's a piece in there you want to buy like I said your your credit will go towards that piece so it's not as heavy in cost while you're paying for it at the time because you already paid ahead of time so that's it and it i have a lot of jewelry now because of this product and it's like good quality of jewelry so i really love this service so that's i have had this box for like a month i have tried everything that's in it i am i already bought the one that i want to keep so i need to send it back so they can send me a new box so that's what I'm gonna do today um, I saw that to say I need to go to the post office now am I gonna take y'all with me probably not probably not I realized when I'm vlogging outside I can concentrate on the things I'm doing um I have not been diagnosed but I'm pretty sure I have a slight ADHD I cannot focus all the time that's why sometimes when I'm talking to you all, I jump from topic to topic to topic to topic back to the same topic I was just talking about two weeks ago. Because I will say a few minutes ago. So yeah, that's it. Um, be on the lookout for the for the get, the get ready with me. But be on the lookout for the morning routine. Be on the lookout for the morning routine. And also I did do a get ready with me that's going up the Friday before this Monday. So the Friday... If I y'all see this vlog this the Monday, that's gonna go up. So, yeah. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, I feel like I should wrap up the vlog here and say thank you holistically, personally. I wish I could say financially because I'm not really providing for y'all. But I want to say thank you guys so much for watching all the way to this point. If you're a returning subscriber. You're the real MVP and I really appreciate you for like rocking with me and watching me and supporting me. I mean, I know you know me from nowhere but the wind. But I really appreciate that you keep coming back and watching. And if you're new and you haven't hit that subscribe button, I'm starting to feel like we have beef. But yet, you haven't told me why we have beef. Because like I always say in my video, I'm always open to constructive criticism as to why you wouldn't sub subscribe to me. Because then we can fix our relationship. So, I want you to take a little bit of time to go onto the subscription and hit the subscribe button. It's like the little button at the bottom that says subscribe. Just hit that. Uh, if you don't like me or for whatever reason you don't think we're vibing, hit the dislike button and then tell me why. Because I can fix it. I really feel like I can fix our relationship. There's Nothing is unfixable. Everything can be fixed. So, either you hit the subscribe button or you tell me why you won't subscribe. 
I'm sorry. I got a little aggressive there. I'm really back in. So yeah. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. If you're a returning subscriber, hit the like button. Because the only way people are going to know you like me or that my videos are even decent is if you hit the like button or you make a comment. And I really appreciate you guys so, 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 so much. And I will catch you guys in the next vlog slash video. Walk through the fire, the sun.